Hello, I'm glad you're here. Today we're talking about the Comica CVM VM10 K2. They're crazy with these names. I don't know why they make the names the way they do. They're crazy. Um, so this is a cell phone mic, a uh, kind of a cell phone holder mic thing. So you've got like the mic there and the little cell phone, I'll show you. So I got this sent to me a while back and I was asked to do a review on it and I actually used it for one of my videos. I used it for the, uh, the vlog that I did about my trip to Daytona and I'll link that up here, check the card out. So it comes in this case, which is awesome. I really like, I really like this uh, zip case. A lot of their other stuff I've gotten has just come, in, just come in boxes. It hasn't come in an actual case. This one can't, comes in a case, and it's uh, just a zip case with a handle. So we'll open this up, and inside there's nice foam that holds everything in, and then you got some pouches up top with some additional stuff. So let's take a look. So up top, we've got a manual. We've got like a warranty card and stuff. I don't know if the manual really, you don't need the manual. You don't need it. So first components, the Comica tripod thing itself. Now I like this because this has a good grip. It kind of shifts a little bit, but it's solid when you're holding it like very centered. And then this button, here, you press and it allows you to fairly easily manipulate the top of this. So this I like a lot, this is good. Next is the uh, phone holder piece. So this one has a wheel at the bottom that you can use to tighten the quarter 20 that's on the bottom. It also has like a sticky pad so it don't move on a tripod or something. But the one thing I don't really like so much is to put your phone in this, which it has a cold shoe, of course, for the microphone. Put your phone in this. You have to twist this knob at the back here. Now, look at this. It takes forever to open this up. I've used spring-loaded ones like this. Um, the spring-loaded ones are pretty good, but this, I mean, it'll hold your phone in. If you're gonna keep it in for a long period of time, this is good, but I just kinda like the spring-loaded ones. Um, and this is also just very, it's very bulky. Like it's just a lot of, a lot of plastic, very thick. Now, instead of this one, I actually prefer one that I bought a while back for use with another setup. Um, and that's from the company Ulanzi. Ulanzi, I don't know if you can see that, Ulanzi. This one is actually metal and it's spring loaded so that um, it's always gonna pop open when you are unlocking it but it tightens down very quickly with this knob it just i don't know it for some reason it it opens and closes faster it also has some cutouts where the the uh, phone fits in better the other one is kind of just rounded off it's not really you know it's just kind of rounded off it doesn't have quite have the very slim cutout that this one has which i actually prefer um it's also just less bulky i mean look at that the difference just easier to travel with. Um, and it's metal, and it has the cold shoe, and it's got the quarter 20 on the bottom. So I prefer this one, and actually when I was using this in Daytona, I was actually using the whole kit, but I was using this guy instead of the other one. So I got my phone here. That's what it looks like when you put your phone in there. And then it's got the cold shoe, and it's also got another quarter 20 on the top. Basically, tripod, you kind of like can put it here in the bottom and then use the dial there to tighten it down, which actually that goes on very quick. And then lastly, we've got the microphone itself. It is just a little kind of uh, almost like a um, Rode Video Mic Pro, Video Micro. I don't remember the name of the one, but very small. It comes with a windscreen. And then also in addition to the windscreen, it also comes with a dead cat. And then of course you get your um, cable. Now you've got two ends to this. You've got the microphone end and then the phone end. It's labeled, so it says on the label for smartphone so that you know which end. But basically the black end goes into the microphone. And then you'll plug the gray end that says for smartphone into, and there's actually a little picture of a smartphone on there. 
that will go into your phone. Now, if you're like me and you have a phone that doesn't have a headphone jack, you're gonna need an adapter. So for Apple, of course, you need this little doohickey, the little um, Apple Lightning to three and a half millimeter. So you'd plug that one in here, and then you'd plug this guy in here, and then this guy will mount right on top here, on top of the hot shoe, and then you just tighten that down, and bam, there you go. Pretty cool, right? It works pretty good too, I gotta say. Um, but yeah, I'll, I'll uh, check out that video of Daytona that I got over here. Um, I recorded the majority of that with this. If you guys are looking for a little vlogging setup like this with a mic um, and a little tripod, it's very compact. You can put it in that case and it's uh, just slipping in a backpack. It's pretty awesome. Um, so if you guys are looking for something like this, definitely check it out. Um, there's a link down in the description if you'd like to purchase it. Uh, through Amazon, of course, that's an affiliate link so that uh, any any of the purchase you guys make through that link supports me, so I appreciate it. Um, and if you guys like this video, uh, throw a like on it. And if you guys would like to see more stuff like this, uh, please subscribe. And if you guys have any suggestions, things you'd like to see reviewed, please let me know. And I will catch you guys in the next one.